So how's daylight savings time affecting you? You know, we got an extra hour of sleep, but we're sleeping less. <laughs> More about that coming up right after this. Jim, and welcome to It's a Highway Vlog, where you get to travel the country with us, and you don't even have to leave a bar stool. I'm sure it's five o'clock somewhere, so while you're just sitting there, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring that little notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Hey, good afternoon. We are back out on the road. Um, we are in, where are we at? Illinois? Someplace? Yep. Someplace that we can't pronounce. <laughs> At That's Catal. M-A-S-C-O-U-T-A-H. Mascout Tall. I don't know. Illinois. Yeah. We're the Loves in Illinois. There you go. And uh, we picked up this morning. Uh, actually, yesterday we picked up in Ohio and came out here to Missouri and unloaded this morning. And then we picked up another load in Missouri and are headed to North Carolina. And we'll unload there in the morning. And then we don't have a load. So far, that. we so don't far, know what we're doing. We did have a load, but then they took it away from us. Yeah, it actually got bumped out. It today. got bumped out till the next day. But it day. wasn't going very far, so, so it was not, yeah. not quite worth waiting on a day. So we are here. Uh, we stopped to change drivers. Uh, and uh, that's what we're doing, changing drivers. Got my handy-dandy little, I don't know what you want to call this. But now I can move. It's like a selfie stick, sort of. Yeah, except for it won't do very good while we're driving down the road. No, it would not because do very good Because your hands are going like this. But it, it's like a tripod thing. And I'd show you a picture of it, but that's impossible. Um, it's like trying to bite your elbow. Or something. Yeah, it's like trying to bite your elbow or scratch your... I don't know what it's like. But anyway, so we got this. Uh, last night was a little rough. Um, I know a little rough for me. <laughs> it's a little rough for her. We really got hit hard with the time change. Uh, usually, this is the one that I like. I like the one in the fall. Well, I like the one in the fall because I drive at nights, and so I get an extra hour of daylight. Uh, she loses a day of daylight because 4.30 in the afternoon is just way too soon. Yeah, <laughs> for it to be dark. dark. It was so dark last night. <laughs> so we are we're not for sure we like that. Um yeah, I cut out about, what, 11 last night? Yeah. yeah and I normally drive until 1.30 or 2. I probably just couldn't do it. Probably as early as we've switched in a long, long time. But she was just, she said, I'm just going to stop. And I'm like, okay, I'll drive. Well, and we had plenty of time on the load, too. Yeah. But yeah, was... I ended up, after we got there, we ended up sitting for like four hours at the customers. So it was not that bad. But I had to drive. And so I'm going to go to bed early today um, so I can get my sleep back because we don't know what's coming after tomorrow. So, but daylight savings time, I don't know. I don't like the one in the spring. This one's usually okay for me, but apparently Judy's just not gonna like it. Well, it's usually okay, but being home for some reason, when we first switched over, I was up at 3.30 in the morning and could not go back to sleep. And then the morning before that, I got up at 3.30. It was almost like we should have changed shifts or something. Yeah. I don't know why. Should I should have done something. So. I was up like that. But sometimes that happens so. where Look at this. Look at this new feature. You see that? Look at that. Interruption. I was talking. <laughs> like a kid with a new toy. Literally. Yeah. Oh, look. A bush. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Inside joke. Sorry. Yeah. Our kids will get it. <laughs> um, but anyway, I can't remember what I was saying now. So you were home. So rudely daylight, interrupted. You were home. Daylight savings time was messing with you. Yeah. It was messing with me. But I was just saying that sometimes... You know, even though we are on a schedule, we sometimes, within an hour or two, might um, change it up sometimes, and and sometimes that works, and sometimes it doesn't. So I'm hoping I'm back on track tonight and won't get yeah, so tired. So we've swapped out. What time is it? I don't Ish. know. You always ask me what time it is. It's quarter after one. I would have a phone, a watch, but I'm recording on it, so I can't see the time. Yeah. So what time you is just, it? Quarter after one. Quarter after one. By the time you get done, ask it'll be one thirty. Yeah. <laughs> so we had a good time at home, and now we're going to try to come out and make money. We are going home, I think, in two Just weeks. Just a couple weeks, yeah. A couple of days. You have an eye appointment, and uh, yeah, I have to go have my eyes.
eyes looked at. And we have a Thanksgiving. Uh, actually, I just got new glasses. I got to go back in and have a, like a checkup. And then, yeah, we have Thanksgiving. Judy's family is huge. I mean, we're talking 150 people at Thanksgiving dinner uh, because her dad's one of 12. And yeah. it's like that whole side. It's like a huge family reunion. So we're going to that. We try to get home for that every year. It's always the week before Thanksgiving. It's a real fun time. Just a lot of people making a lot of noise. We have it in old school gymnasium is what we have it. Yeah. <laughs> so we will be out the rest of this week, probably over the weekend, and then go home for that. And then after that, we will come out and probably run up until the week of Christmas. Uh, I think Christmas is in the middle of the week. I don't really know. So we'll try to get home three or four days before Christmas uh, to do some last minute Christmas shopping. Another thing that Judy's family likes to do, last second, literally Christmas shopping. Oh, hey. As they're closing <laughs> doors at Walmart at four o'clock on Christmas Eve, they're in there. Well, um, not Christmas Eve usually. Christmas Day, maybe. Christmas, not Christmas Day, Christmas Eve Day, no, I guess you're right. Place is open on Christmas Day, honey. Yeah, no, not much. Not much, anyway. But this, this was supposed to kind of go along with our last sleep vlog a little bit, you know, with the daylight savings time, so. Right, yeah, because now we could actually use some of those tips on how to stay asleep. I had no problem sleeping last night. I just didn't get very much sleep. Yeah, and that's sometimes what happens, too. Yeah. It's hard. Uh, Between pickups and deliveries, we were supposed to pick up at 4 yesterday, and we didn't get picked up until 7 o'clock last right. night. Right, yeah, so which her. Which then throws your whole time our off. Our whole clocks were, were just off. Yeah. So hopefully we can get back on track. And, uh, and later we'll talk a little bit more about sleep and some other pointers and tips that I've remembered since we did the last one. But right. we won't go into now because it's now like a 10 minute little video here. Yeah, it's getting there. <laughs> so, yeah. So anyway, that's what we're doing. If you like stuff like this, even if you don't, uh, like and subscribe. Thank you to everyone that has done that. We yes, really, really appreciate 2, it. 2,000 views. 2,000 views and 100 subscribers this last couple days. So, yeah. yeah. So, tell your friends. Invite everybody over. <laughs> we like company. <laughs> yeah. But thanks again, and we will... We'll try to clean up, too. Make sure everything's clean. Before. Yeah. <laughs> and we'll see you in the next video, right? All right. So long, everybody. Bye-bye.